Are you in the market to buy a home? Well, make sure you are not paying more than you should. Yes, WCNC Charlotte's Carolyn Brock is joining us now with the signs a home is overpriced. And we don't want to be asking where's the money, but I suspect this is going to be the first step, right? Well, here's the thing. There are four signs a home is overpriced, and this is according to Realtor.com. Uh, the time on the market, this is a good indicator. So if a home sits on the market longer than others in the area, it is a sign that it might be priced too high. Right now in Charlotte, we are still a seller's market. That means there are more people looking to buy a home than homes are available. The average uh, days that that home sits on the market is 45. So keep that in mind. The second sign to look for is that the comps are less. So most properties will have comparable homes. That's what comps is, is, is uh, short for that have sold recently. Those prices should be in the same price range. So don't get your heart set on something and then see that the comps are a lot less because then you'll know you're going to be paying more for that. The third sign on and off listing. This is kind of a, a trick according to realtor.com. So you got to look at the property history. So most online listings will have a property history and it'll tell you when was this property listed and when was it sold? If you see it listed, not sold listed, then not sold. You know that they're taking it on and off kind of to manipulate a little bit to make it look new when the property in fact has been on and off the market for a while. The fourth sign is it's not selling when others in the same neighborhood are selling. So if the homes in the neighborhood are selling at a certain rate, so say like typically for that area, they're selling, uh, I don't know, 30 days. This home should be selling around that same time. So if they're not, that is a sign that that home is priced too high. So those are four signs a home is overpriced. We just don't want you to pay more than you should. Absolutely, good tips there. So difficult too, since the market is like I feel like the market is in transition, so. It's definitely in transition, but yeah. there's still a lot of competition. And so sometimes you feel the need that you need to jump on something, right? Mm -hmm. But Knowing you could. It's the first part of the battle. Yep, yeah. yep. Then you got to go, I know, and I know. And I know. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Thank you, Carolyn.